Hi everybody, it's Song here. So today I'm going to share with you guys how I make this ornament. This is a very simple project to do, and if you do it, it will take you like half an hour, which is nothing at all, or to like maybe at most an hour. So it's very very simple. Most of the time, you're just waiting for the paint to dry, and the decoration part is extremely easy. So just let me show you how to do it. First, just take your white paint or gesso and cover the whole shadow box with it, and then take any of your texture paste. I chose a texture paste that has the glimmer to it. It's like、um, modeling cream from Viva Decor, but I made this myself. Now, just using your heating tool and let it bubble up and heat set it. Now you're just gonna take a glimmer mist that just has glimmer in it and just spray it all over the shadow box to give it extra shine. Now at this point, I still think it is not shiny enough, so I took another、um, Perfect Pro mica powder and it just brushed all over the shadow box. To me, Christmas ornament can never be too blingy or too shiny. So make it as blingy as you want; it will be okay as Christmas ornament, right? So now I'm just taking a trim, which you can get in Sakura to the store, and I just hug glue it over the edges. And when I cut this trim out, it has some、um, nettings around the edges. Make sure to trim it off if you're going to adhere it to the edge of this、um, shadow box, so the netting don't show up. But if you don't care, that's okay. But I prefer them not to show up. This is a frame you can get in Sakura store. It is in MDF wood, but you can also get it in chipboard material.、Um, what I'm doing is just I'm going over it with a silver metallic paint, and then I, after it dried, I went over it with、um, a white pearl paint, and then I use my Inca gold metallic wrap in、um, silver color and just rub it over the、um, frame to give it. The extra, extra silver and extra sun,、uh, extra shine, so it looks, you know, more Christmassy. Now I am using a Viva Decor、um, pearl pen, which is also like liquid pearl, and you just、um, make little pearl dot all over the edges of the shadow box, which I think is more decorative than the plain wood edges. So you can do it, or you don't have to do it. It's your choice. But I like the look. I like my Christmas ornament to be bling. This is the Christmas tree that you can get in her store, and when you buy it, you get six pieces with three different sizes. So I like it; it's very, very cool. What I'm doing here is I'm just painting it with my iridescent medium. I I did it layers by layers and by layers until it's covered, until the wood color is not showing through. The reason that I use this、um, iridescent medium instead of metallic paint is because I think my personally I think. It has the extra shine and the reflection that a metallic paint doesn't have, and because it is more transparent, it is not as opaque. So I don't know; it just looks better. It looks more snowy and icy kind of look. So I like it. And now I just go over it with some、um, Viva Decor modeling cream, which is like a glimmer texture paste, and then dry it, bubble it up, and use my Inca Gold in gold color to、um, rub over the.、Um, Raised part or texture part to make them, I don't know, more defined. I was going to make them look like snow, but then I, I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to make it look like snow. I'm just going to make it gold color. Yeah, sometimes I change my mind. And here I am just painting these two cute gloves in off-white color. You can get it in her store. These two gloves, they're just adorable. I love them. After the paint is dried, I went over the edges with my Inca Gold metallic rub in gold color to give it more、um, defined look and it's not so boring. And then I just adhere it down、uh, to the sides of the ornament to make it look like it has two hands, which I think is super cute. Then I took a puffy paint to paint over the、um, Christmas tree to make it look like it has snow or to define it whatever way you want. It just it looks better, I think. And then I just. 
use some snowflake sequins, which you can get in arts and craft store. Just go to the aisle where they have tons of sequins. You will see them, and which I think they're really really cute. Um, after I hair I hair them down, I used my speckles or any kind of glitter glue you have. Went over these um, snowflakes to give them extra extra shininess. And yeah, here it is. It's my Christmas ornament, and you can make one. It's extremely easy. And I hope you like it. I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.